Welcome, Clash Cut Crew, to adding a player to every team in Madden until they win the Super Bowl. I did this with all 30 teams in MLB The Show, and I may have lost 10 years off of my life. So I don't know how stressed out I'm going to be doing this in Madden, but if I'm going to be starting with my Seahawks, I got to get my Seahawks gear. Bobby Wagner? No. Plays for a different team now. Doug Baldwin? No, he's retired. Russell Wilson? I, I honestly don't even know what to say anymore. Hey, what about this one? DK Metcalf. Let me throw that on. There we go. He's still here for now. Before we get started, I would appreciate it so much if you guys would like the video, subscribe if you haven't already. Because if you were there for me every step of the way when we were doing this and MLB The Show, you know how stressful it was and how much work I put into that series. And we're doing it all again here in Madden. Let's get started. Here's how the process will go. The wheels are a little more complicated for this. We have an offense and defense wheel that will pick which side of the ball we're getting a player from. For offense, you got QB running back, a wide receiver one, two, and three, tight end, the offensive line, you pick, and phone a friend. For defense, we have all of the defensive line, the secondary, and also you pick and phone a friend. Then of course we have the NFL team wheel that will determine which team we're getting a player from. Let's get started right now by spinning the wheel. I miss that feeling so much. It's been such a long time. We got, oh, this could be amazing. We really want offense. Come on. That thing is moving fast. Come on. Offense, offense, offense. Give us Offense, yes! We have a chance. The great thing about landing on offense with the Dolphins is wide receiver one and two are both great options. Tyreek Hill and Jalen Waddle. And there's also you pick, also phone a friend. Hopefully we land on one of them. We spin it, we get a phone a friend. Hopefully, whatever friend I call likes me. The very first person I decided to call for the very first video and adding a player until they win the Super Bowl in Madden is Little Kirsch. How you doing, Little Kirsch? I'm doing good. How we doing? How we doing? Well, today we are the Seahawks, and this is the very first trade we will be making, and we're getting somebody from the Dolphins, and it has to be an offensive player. You have that choice. Now, are you going to start us off on the right foot, or are you going to screw me over? Oh, come on, man. Tyreek Hill, bro. What are we doing? Yes, sir! <laughs> see, I knew I could trust Little Kirsch. He wouldn't screw me over, right? Yeah, see, come on now. There you go. Tyreek Hill, a part of the Seahawks wide receiving core with Tyler Lockett and DK Metcalf. Oh, my God. Now, here's the great thing about this series. A baseball season is 162 games. The football season is 18 weeks. Much easier, gonna go by much faster, hopefully it will be, hopefully, less stressful. We'll get through each season, and it might take longer, adding players, getting to the Super Bowl, but with how fast the seasons will go, it won't be as annoying. And I just wanted to come into the game and kind of explain how things are gonna be working with the simulations, because I have no control. This is all gonna be computers, and they're gonna have to get the job done on their own. I would also like to see Tyreek Hill in uniform he is nowhere to be seen right now i don't know oh there he is oh he was there for like a brief second super sim that's how we're gonna do this and then to watch the gameplay we have to change it to slow we're actually not gonna be doing that for this first drive because we're the ones kicking off i just want to see some action you know and the broncos will actually be taking this ball there you go and they're not going anywhere so let's change it to normal and then we'll do jump to next play and we can do this a lot faster incomplete pass by russ three yard rush and then on this one a nine yard catch oh man they're actually moving downfield pretty well i don't like this are they gonna get to the end zone i hope not oh my god he is moving this ball two yard rush by chase edmonds next seven yard catch after that another five yard rush they're at least getting a field goal out of this can the seahawks please stop them bro wait what happened interception cody barton for 70 yards so now, check this out. I'll change it back to slow because we're going to be on the field right here. There you go. I wonder if I can change the camera angle to see things closer. That would be nice. I just want to see Tyreek Hill make a catch. That's what I want. And, oh, is that him? That's Tyreek Hill. And he, oh, he almost went all the way. 
Oh my god, there he is in the Seahawks uni. Check him out over on the right. Geno Smith did not miss that. And if that safety was not protecting, he's gone. Tyreek Hill at the bottom of your screen, but it looks like it's going to be a run play. No, it's not. What's Geno going to do? He's going to hit Tyreek Hill in the end zone. His first score with the Seahawks. Let's go. Oh, and he hits a backflip. I love it. I love you. So now that we've been entertained, I want to jump ahead. Let's just go to the next quarter and let's put it on fast so this goes by. And the Broncos got nothing in the first quarter. That's what we like. And screw it. Let's just go one more quarter right now. Seahawks, they got in the end zone again. Broncos, they finally got there and they tied it up. Damn it. We got a field goal and going into the third quarter, we are winning. We're going to have to be winning a lot if we're going to make playoffs. And that's the end zone. They also got the end zone. We've got it again they had the lead oh man they're up by one so now i'll break it down by possession we got a field goal got us the lead broncos i think they punted it away yes they did i got 15 minute quarters on the broncos just hit a 26 yard catch right there and next up oh yeah we saw the 26 yard catch first and goal two yard rush please do not get in the end zone i will be heartbroken if we lose this game oh they did oh my god it looks like the seahawks are gonna have a minute left you can hit tyreek hill on a go route that is what i would do right here geno smith here's the snap he's going for the big ball let's see hail mary and it falls he'll get one more shot geno smith waiting looking still waiting oh my god what is he doing that was the worst ending ever so unfortunately we take that l in week one but now i will send to the end of the season see if we can actually get in the playoffs unfortunately we did not make playoffs we actually finished in dead last tying with the cardinals well on to the next year this was the super bowl cowboys and browns cowboys pulled it off time for another player where are they coming from it is going to be the cowboys the guys that just won the Super Bowl. Offense or defense? I feel like our problem is quarterback, but I wouldn't say no to some of the defensive players the Cowboys have. We get offense again. The good thing about the Cowboys offense is they have a lot of options. I just want to know which one are we going to get? It'll be tight end. That would be Dalton Schultz, which is an upgrade at tight end. I will say, even though the seasons are shorter in Madden, simulation is a lot slower than MLB. Second and 10. The throw is intercepted! Let's go, man! Tariq Woolen, balling in real life and in the video game. And we will start the year with a W over the Rams. Instead of simming all the way to the end, let's go to mid-season so we can kind of get a vibe of how our year's going. I mean, we're in first place, but we're not hanging on to it by much. Please hang on to this till the end of the year. I just want to get to playoffs as fast as I can. How the mighty have fallen. We go from first to last, but we were also tied for second because the other teams were seven to 10. Another year, another spin of the NFL team wheel. We are going to get the Packers. Offense or defense? What are we getting? It is gonna be defense. I wanted Aaron Rodgers. And the defensive player we get from the Packers will be a corner. Let's go. That was like the only position I knew exactly who it was on the team. Jair Alexander. He is going to make our secondary so much better. Just rip the band-aid off. I already know. Yeah, game over. Not a good start. Man, two and four, but I mean, the division ain't out of reach. The problem is 100% Gino. It's Gino era in real life right now, but like, I don't think Gino's gonna get the job done for us in Madden. Six and 11, dude. Come on, the Cardinals finished seven and 10. This was the year we could have pulled it off. Gino ain't gonna cut it if we're gonna get the Seahawks to win the Super Bowl. Hold on. I've never needed to hit offense more than right now. Please, I am begging you to give us offense. Thank you, just barely. You guys know who we want, and let's see if the wheel is gonna be kind enough to give us what we want. It is going to be, stop on you pick. Oh my God, is it there? Is it, yes, 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 yes. Wow, that was so close. Obviously I'm picking Josh Allen. We are finally 
out of the Geno Smith era. Two yards out, where's Tyreek Hill? Okay, he's the middle receiver in the bunch right there with Tyler Lockett and DK Metcalf. And I think DK has the touchdown! Josh Allen's first touchdown pass as a Seahawk goes to DK. Look at his node, beautiful. 24 yard touchdown, Josh Allen to DK Metcalf. I keep missing all this, dude. I wanna go down on the field again, damn it. Big 49 yard touchdown! How do I keep missing all these? That's DK's third of the game. Game over, that it, let's go. We start off 1-0 putting up 41, dude. This is the best I have felt about any of our seasons. And if we are not in first place midway, then I'm gonna be pissed. Third place? Come on, man. What is it gonna take? Things better change by the end of the year. That's all I know. Seven and 10? How does that happen? If you know how to stop the computers from trading, Please tell me, because they are making way too many moves. Right now, I have to figure out what team I will be trading with, and that will be the Ravens. I don't really think we need much more offensively. Maybe some offensive line, but I wouldn't be mad at defense, which is what we're going to get. I'm going to keep it a buck with you. Unless they're a superstar, I don't know many defensive players in football and we get a middle linebacker right here. Well, that's a nice upgrade. Roquan Smith is our new middle linebacker. But if they make a catch right here, oh, he's going Hail Mary. He's going for the big play. And there's a flag and, oh, he almost caught it. No! Oh my God. A bunch of idiots. Why? We could have taken this to overtime and they call P.I. You let them fight it out, dude, and we take an L. So unfortunately, I think what I have to do is every like two years, I'm gonna have to exit the franchise, start a new one, add the players we already had, because if we keep going year after year after year after year after year after year, the NFL gets unrecognizable. I don't know how to stop the teams from constantly trading. They were taking away players from us and I was like dude I did not say yes to this I would just like to see a positive record we're going to mid-season right now three and four I why what sim in the playoffs will we actually be in them is the question six and eleven what is wrong I don't get how it's so hard for a team led by Josh Allen with the receivers he's been given oh oh Chiefs we don't really need Patrick Mahomes we have Josh Allen Maybe our problem is defense. Who are we going to get from the Chiefs defense? It'll be, you pick? Okay, I honestly don't know who I'm gonna pick because I don't know the Chiefs defense that well. Well, you can see team needs. Defensive tackle is our second most needed. And the Chiefs got Chris Jones at defensive tackle. Let's go. You know what? I'm just gonna go straight to semi to mid season because I feel like all those week one games that we keep watching, are not doing us any luck. What? Last place. Two and five. Fellas, fellas, fellas. Is Josh Allen ass? Another seven and 10 season? What the hell? I don't know why this Seahawks team refuses to win. We got Eagles. I don't even know what we need to get us away from a negative record, but this sucks. I know that for sure. Offense. For offense, we are going to land on right tackle why do i feel like i should just be ready for disappointment going to mid-season oh the right tackle we got from the eagles lane johnson my brain cannot comprehend how we're not balling out every week but for once we were at the top of the division now are we going to hold it finally we made playoffs but we're a wild card against the lions i don't care we can literally just have a good run and we could finally do this guys josh allen is definitely a quarterback that i believe could get hot in playoffs and go absolutely nuts well i hope jared goff has no response for that and right as i say that he's getting hot and they're probably gonna be in the end zone any moment now there it is a team led by Josh Allen should not be struggling with all of these weapons on his squad. And he's out of the pocket. He's just going to dump it off to Kenneth Walker. We're going to get a field goal. 
I hope. Field goal is good. Yes, it is. All right. Now can the Lions not do a single? Oh, interception, Jair Alexander. Oh, Kenneth Walker gets in for a touchdown. We have the lead. Oh, yeah. Oh, how do we get it now? I, I don't know how we just got it again. Putting all this pressure on us, man. They're at the nine. They're at the two. Oh, it was a touchdown. I, never mind. And I will go down to the field on the 20-yard line, third and two. We really need to get points here. Preferably a touchdown. And no! What happened? We, we went for it. We didn't get it. Or did we? What? No. What happened? I'm so confused. We're passing. We're good. And we're rolling out. Josh. Oh my God. Why? Now the field goal. Yes. There we go. Field goal. Touchdown. Oh, halfback draw. Kenneth Walker into the end zone. Let's go, man. And now, Josh Allen passing for some reason, and DK Metcalf. I think we can sim to the end of the game. I think we got this locked up. Any more scoring? They got a touchdown, but it did not matter. We're moving on to the next round of playoffs. It's going to be against Tampa Bay and Tom Brady, and it's a hot opponent, according to this. Tom Brady's old. We have Josh Allen, young, stud, superstar quarterback. I really hope he's playing with that kind of attitude and we go out there and ball. Fourth and 22. Okay, they're going to get a field goal though. Ooh, nice little big pass right there. 18 yards. And then we get a nine yard pass and a big touchdown. Josh Allen to Tyreek Hill. And what happened there? Interception. Let's go. All right, well, we get the field goal and ah, that just sucks because I needed that two score lead. And now Tom Brady's moving this ball like crazy. Oh my, no, stop them, please. He's second and ten, third and ten, and what was this? All right, eight yards, and no. No, they went for it and got it and got in the end zone. Are you kidding me? Third and three. All right. It looks like we got a seven yard rush by Josh Allen. And then a big pass right there. 20 yards to Tyreek Hill. And what was this? Interception. I love it. Third and six. And touchdown. Touchdown to DK Metcalf. That's what we needed. Interception. Oh my God. All of a sudden. Oh, whoa. Thought it was going to be a run. It's going to be a pass. And that's exactly where I was looking. And oh, Tyler Lockett. What, touchdown? No, first down at the one. We should be getting a touchdown to the fullback, which is our tight end, Noah Fant. Fourth and one, it's game. It doesn't matter. We go on to the next round, man. We're either going to be facing the Cowboys or the Packers. It's going to be the Packers. There is history in the playoffs between Green Bay and Seattle. And you know who usually comes out on the good end in this matchup? Seattle. Third and five. It's a touchdown. Damn it. Josh Allen to wake up. What just happened? 92 yard run for a touchdown. Kenneth Walker. We did not capitalize. Field goal though. Okay, we got the field goal. Come on, you got so many talented receivers that you could throw. Oh, right up the middle. Right. No. Kenneth Walker was wide open. All right. Well, should be a field goal. It is. All right. Hopefully the Packers stay cold. First and goal. They're going to score. Damn it. We literally have to get to the one to get a new first down. And oh, I didn't even. Whoa. I thought he was throwing it. Whoa. DK. He got to the one. No mistakes right here. Kenneth Walker to the outside is in. Let's go, man. He is single-handedly keeping us in this game. Oh, we went for two. Smart. Three straight passes that were incomplete. All right, man. We really, really got to get in that end zone one more time. We do. Oh, there it is. Kenneth Walker. Game of his life right now. They get a field goal. What amazing stand by the defense. Oh, what happened? Interception! Quandre digs. I wouldn't be shocked if we just run the ball to death. A little jet sweep. Might actually get to the end zone. Tyler Lockett. We are going to the Super Bowl. But remember, we add players until we win the Super Bowl. That's what we got to do. Two teams that were both 10 and 7 meeting each other at Super Bowl 57. It takes place in the desert. Lamar Jackson. I'm already scared that he is going to tear us apart. But we got Tyreek Hill. We know a thing or two about speed as well. And when you got a quarterback in a running back combo like Josh Allen and Kenneth Walker, ooh, watch out. There's Joshy boy. Come on. I told you. What did I say at the beginning of playoffs? If there's any quarterback, that could get hot and have a run in playoffs, 
Josh Allen is the guy. Looks like the Ravens are getting the ball first. And it looks like things are going our way to start. Third and 16, fourth and 12. Punt that ball. Give it. Wait, did he return it? Is that what that gray line is? Yes! Tyreek Hill returned it for a touchdown. First and goal, second and goal, and they're in. And then every time they convert, they just keep on rolling. And they're going to be in the end zone any second now. I can guarantee it. Fourth and one. Field goal, right? N incomplete. Wait, they went for it. Oh my god, yes. Oh my god, yes. 89 yard touchdown. Kenneth Walker gives us the lead. Third and six, where they stopped. No, it's a seven yard touchdown. Oh no, he kicked the field goal. Okay. Fourth and 18, field goal. Damn it. I mean, Tucker's going to make those. We are going to throw. He's going to roll out. He's going to hit the running back still. Tyler Lockett's like, you know, these guys are on your team, right? He's gonna roll out again, and he's gonna... Do, did you tiptoe? Yeah! It might be overturned, but for now, yeah! Computers aren't the smartest, but if he somehow gets a touchdown here, I'll be amazed. And of course not. At least it'll be a field goal. All right, we have the lead. Now we need to stop them, dude. Fourth and one, and we put... No, field goal! Turn, wait, what? How? Huh? No, no, well, actually, yeah, 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 there's a field goal. I don't know why we were still, I still thought we were tied at 17. So I was like, how'd we get six? Third and seven. No, yeah, no. <sighs> Josh, I need you, man. Let's see. Josh Allen passing, throwing, caught, first down. With a two minute warning hitting right now. Third and eight. I know we want to kill time, but I want to get in the end zone. Josh Allen drops way back, caught, and oh my god, Tyler Lockett is stopped at the two. Okay, it's down, the kick is up, and it is good. We have the lead. I gotta see how this is gonna end. Second and four from their own 31. Lamar Jackson, he's moving. Don't let him get him on the fumble! Fumble, we win! We're gonna win! Lamar Jackson fumbles! It is picked up by Chris Jones! The trade we got from Kansas City! Let me see this. And it, dude, I don't even know exactly what happened. That would, can we see another? It, he just got bumped and he like, let it go. But that'll do it. That will do it! Let's go! I really am curious who won Super Bowl MVP. Josh Allen did not even throw a touchdown in this game. I think it could be Kenneth Walker. You guys know the drill. We are going to get through all of the football teams. And you get to vote on which team is going to be next. It is going to be posted on my community tab here on my channel. So make sure you keep your eyes open for that. I really wonder what team will be next. That is up to you. I got this. You got this. We all got this. Like the video. Subscribe. Tell your mom, your dad, your grandma, your grandpa, your pets, your friends, your everybody you know to subscribe to them already. I will see you next time.